Hello out there YouTube friends, I'm Cindy. This is Sincerely Cindy Settle. I'm so excited to have you with me today. I'm doing a collaboration with five other fantastic YouTube creators to bring you some holiday looks, shopping your own closet. I hope we can bring you some inspiration of some ideas and things that you can find in your own closet for your holiday looks this holiday season. so excited to be bringing this video to you guys today. I'm collaborating with five fantastic YouTube creators to bring this video to you. If you have not checked out their channel, I hope that you will check out their channel and subscribe. Show them some love. I am working today with Laura from Little Box of Happy, Debbie and Cindy from Sisters and Stitches, Kristen from Kristen's Moments of Sanctuary, Meredith from Mayor of All Trades, and Alex life from Life as a Life is a City Girl. Life as a City Girl? Life is a City Girl. Life as a City Girl. <laughs> Sorry, Alex. So anyway, I'm so excited to be bringing you this video. These girls um, have been fabulous to work with, and they are bringing you some fantastic looks as well. So I hope that you will check out their channels when you guys finish checking out my video. I'm going to be bringing you some holiday looks from the Thanksgiving season all the way over to New Year's Eve. Um, so I'm gonna give you some looks where each of us, the challenge for this collaboration was to shop our closet. We couldn't buy anything new. We had to shop what we had in our closet for these holiday outings, parties, um, Christmas, um, Hanukkah, anything that we're celebrating, we want to make sure that we are dressed casually, dressy, whatever the uh, appropriate occasion is. We want to make sure that we are dressed um, well and that we look cute. So, first outfit I'm going to bring to you is more of a Thanksgiving outfit for me. So, this year I'm spending Thanksgiving in New York City with my daughter. So, I will be out and about walking. Um, we're going to a restaurant for dinner. So, I do anticipate there being a little bit of wind and it might be a little cold. So, I have added this blanket scarf to my look for Thanksgiving. I've included my hair up because the scarf is a little bit suffocating. Um, and when I have my hair down, I don't feel like my hair looks quite as good because it's kind of poofy back here in the back, the scarf is. So I did like the color combination of this. I think it is very fall inspired, um, very Thanksgiving inspired, just with this simple camel sweater. So I'm going to take this off, show you the sweater, and um, step back a little bit so you can see the jeans and the shoes. All right, so super simple look, um, but even if I were staying home and cooking and celebrating here um, with my family, I would probably end up in something of this nature after I finished cooking and that kind of thing, um, either going to my parents' house or staying here. It's a simple, um, lighter weight camel collared sweater with a slight balloon sleeve. This came from Nordstrom. If they still have it, um, I will be sure to link it down below. Um, my husband actually got me this on sale as an anniversary gift. Um, back in June, actually. It, it was like clearance, like $17 or something. But one of the things that I love about it, not only do I love the way it looks here, but there's a super cute bow and keyhole in the back that gives it a little bit of interest. So I'll turn around so you can see that. So again, another reason for the hair up is to just show off that detail in the back. Let me step back just a little bit. All right, so I have just paired this simple camel collared sweater with a dark pair of um, boot cut jeans. These are democracy jeans that I got from Amazon. They were in an Amazon um, prime wardrobe, I believe. Um, and I, I mean, these are like my favorite, these are becoming my favorite jeans. They have a little bit of elastic right here. So when you eat too much, you know, you got a little bit of room there, and it's very, um, I feel like the look is very slimming, and I, you know, I'm just comfortable in these jeans. I think that they look classic, I think that they look classy, and they are a little bit elevated, um, and dresses it up just a little bit. I've paired it with um, some booties. These are also from Nordstrom. These um, were in a trunk club a, about a month ago or so. You guys probably remember seeing those in the trunk club. I did end up keeping them. So this is look number one. I have um, paired it with just some simple earrings. Since I had the scarf, I didn't want to do too much um, up here. So I did just simple do some simple 
bronze collared earrings to complement the look. All right, let's move on. All right, so the next look from my closet, again, a simple sweater. Um, I love the v-neck of this sweater. It is a emerald greenish kind of collar, so I would wear something like this probably um, like for my daughter's um, dance recital that is Christmas related. I would wear this if I'm going out with friends um, for something that's Christmas themed or a Christmas get together. My book club usually does a Christmas get together um, before the holidays. I would wear something like this if we don't do the ugly Christmas sweater, which we usually do and we usually have some awesome ugly Christmas sweaters. So do you guys do that? Do you guys have like ugly Christmas sweater parties? I'm not very creative so I end up buying one that like lights up or something like that. But anyway, I would wear something like this just to go out to dinner. I would also wear something like this um, on Christmas Eve. Christmas Eve is very um, chill around here. We, I do appetizers. We usually watch a movie or play some games, something like that. So I would be very casual. Um, if I were wearing um, something dressier, I would be wearing this. If I'm not wearing some sort of sweatpant or something more leisurely just to curl up on the couch. But I um, love this collar. I love that it's very um, Christmassy looking without being kind of in your face Christmas. Um, it also does have a cute detail in the back. Again, hair up. Um, I like the look because it has the detail in the back. Cute, right? So this was a stitch fix. Um, I have paired it with the same pants and the same booties. Um, it's just a simple change, simple sweater change. I did change out my earrings to give it a slightly different look. These are just some cute little drop gold earrings that I feel like complement it very well. If I had a gold simple necklace, I would probably pair that there as well to dress it up a little bit, but I don't have one, so we're doing the drop earrings. All right, we have a couple more. I'll be right back. Okay, so I know what you guys are gonna say about this next one. You're gonna be thinking, I'm supposed to get style inspiration from you? And I say yes, but hear me out. <laughs> so here is, um, my outfit number three. Now, I am wearing patterned leggings. These are Christmas reindeer and snowflakes. All right, I know, it's in your face. So, I have um, my black um, tunic top that has the little bit of detailing here. Again, you know, got, you, you guys know, I like the detail. Um, up here around the neck brings the attention up to my face. It is short sleeve. So hear me out. So I would wear an outfit like this or this specific outfit for several different reasons. So number one, I work in the school system. I'm a school psychologist. So I work in elementary schools. So elementary kids love this kind of thing. They love that we get into the spirit and that they can see that we get into the spirit. I know it's not very classy or very chic, um, but I would wear this to work, say, on holiday party day or something like that. Um, I would also wear it. We do a cookie decorating each year with um, some friends of ours. My girls and their girls are friends, and the moms are friends. So we go over to their house. We do some cookie decorating. I would totally wear this outfit there as well. Um, I would be covered up with um, an apron, I'm sure, for decorating purposes, but it's very comfortable. The leggings are very comfortable. They're actually from Walmart. Um, I've had them for like three or four years. I think they're really cute and they're fun. I wear them once or twice a year, um, so they just stay in my closet. The top is a wantable from, I want to say, last fall, and then I have paired it. I've elevated it a little bit with some heels. Um, and high knee-high boots. So I love these boots. I've had these for a couple of years. Um, they are wide enough to accommodate my wide calf, um, and I feel like the heel and the knee-high elevates the look just a little bit. So I have one more outfit for you. I will be right back. All right, so I'm bringing you, this is the last look. So this is totally something that I would wear um, on Christmas Day um, to celebrate Christmas with the family, especially if I'm going out, um, say to my parents. Or, so usually it's my parents' house or my parents come here 
Um, so if I were going somewhere, I would probably dress up a little bit. If we're staying home, I would probably just wear jeans and a cute sweater like a couple of the previous outfits. But this is a little bit elevated, little stepping it up a little bit. Again, I like the V-neck of this dress. I think the pattern is cute and very holiday-ish. Um, I like that it is cinched here in the chest area and then it kind of flares out a little bit. I do have it paired with tights, black tights, and then the knee-high boots. This would also work with black booties as well. And then I have just some large hoop earrings here. These are also the earrings I had in on the last outfit that I forgot to tell you about. So anyway, this is um, the last look that I have for you today. I don't really have a New Year's look because we typically stay home. Um, so nothing really special there in terms of the outfit that I would be wearing. But um, I wanted to... I wanted to definitely include this Christmas look. This dress came from Perfectly Priscilla. They are an online boutique. I think they actually have in person like a store boutique somewhere. I think Georgia, maybe Atlanta is where it is. So that's where this came from a couple of years ago. So that's all I have for you guys today. I hope that you've enjoyed this collaboration. I hope that you've enjoyed the Shop Your Closet um, content, which is new for me. And if you have not already, please be sure to subscribe. Um, I would love to have you join me and keep following me to see what else I have to bring you. And if you haven't, please, please, please be sure to check out the other ladies' channels, check out their videos. I will have a playlist down below. I will also have their channels linked down below. Show them some love. Let them know that I sent you. And if you're new to my channel, let me know how you found me. Which channel did you find me through? So I would love to know. I would love to say hi to you personally. So let me know which look you like the best and if I should do more of these collaborations. So I will see you guys soon. I hope you have a magical holiday. I'm sincerely Cindy Settle. I'm signing out. I almost forgot.